Alrighty. Alright, as you can see, this is going to be a mod spotlight. I've got a lot of mods. If I'm not going to be doing all my mods I've got right at the moment. Uh, there will be more to come. But these are some mods, actually, some of them just can't just come out very recently. Anyways, this is the mod spotlight. All the mods will be down in the description of the video that you can find. So you can find all of these. So, alright, so the first one is this cat, 75C. This came out pretty recently, I think. Very nice looking tractor scene. I'm guessing a lot of people want to want to see it because I've seen quite a few youtubers doing it next up is this 8R as you can see it's just like the regular one you can turn it up all the way to 8400 wait, it's an 8400R but that's the only thing that's different from the in-game one this is American style so but so here you can do, put weights like that on it uh, real duels with weights on it and then all duels and you also put weights instead of a front point linkage and you can put these big boys on it which I mean I don't know if you'd actually want to do that but we'll just go let's go all of them why not and then I don't think I've, I'm not gonna do any of these tractors this tractor will be in the next one so with this one that's the same this is a little bit different but it's not gonna be in this long spotlight Alrighty, um, another one is this 70 series. It's like the one in game. It's not like the only game, it's a, that's the S series, but this one can have big tires in the back and then row crop. Or six, uh, 650 duels on it with wide tires in the back or just the small guys. We'll just go with this one. Put oversized load on it. I don't really want to do that. And you could put one, two, three, four, five, six on it. And also you can have these big tires on it. But we're just gonna go with these for now. You have to there's no head for this, you just have to use a 45 in it on it. Um I think that's all for now. Yeah. Alright, and then by a header, this is an in-game header for the S series. Then, all right. What was I gonna do next? Oh yeah, I think it might be under plows. Nope. Sub soilers. Nope. Elevators. Nope. That is weird. Go to the. Did it not load into the game or something? Hmm. I had a. Uh... Ha okay, we'll just go with these for now. Alrighty, so this one I've been using a lot of my games as custom modding outside. That's who made it. I don't really know who made this one. I forgot who did. Um. Yeah. Um. Make sure. Give me a quick second here. Um. Uh, we also got a machine shed, and as you can see, we are playing on the Rolling Hills. That's another mod that's in the description. And let's go buy land so I can place a machine shed I've got. Um, that will be fine. That will be fine. Alrighty, so what's happened? <laughs> let's look at an overview of the map. There is farm right here, farm right here. Uh, this is kind of a made up farm, I guess I would know if you'd call it that, but then one cell point. Uh, this is where you buy your animals. This is supposed to be where, this, uh, this is also a farm down here. Uh, this farm right there. Some of it's, like that one is a, I'll hop in the cat. Um, 
That one is kind of like made up, I guess you could say. Like, it's not actual functional, functional, but you can make it functional. This one is functional. This one has a grain tile, so does this one. No, actually, this one doesn't. This is functional, though, too. This one and this one have a grain silo. This is all pasture right here, but he has not had the pasture working yet, but he will. So. Here's a cat, big boy. 345 horse, I think. Yeah, the 325, actually. It's very nice to drive, works fine. Um, everything looks, uh, turn off the engine. No. What's going on here? <laughs> hey, you can't really see anything in the engine. But it looks really nice. I mean, in cab, I mean, it's basic. A lot of things are basic. This is, this is a 1994. I like how everything works in it. So at least just like the thing, and it shows the, uh, it shows the RPMs too here. So the time, I really, I would give this mod a 10 out of 10. Or 5 out of 5 star. Or maybe like a 4.9 because the engine, you can't really see anything in the engine. But like, what are you supposed to expect? The lights do work. Um. Yeah, I'd give this a 10 out of 10. I gotta find that plow though. I'm surprised I haven't been able. I can't find it. Kind of weird. Maybe it's like in the wrong spot. Let's go get something for these two big guys to pull. Next up is going to be the ADAR here in a second. Let's get a... Subsolar. For both, I guess. Yeah, alright. Well, after he chests the combine... Um, and, the, and then when you look at the 8R, we will go test these, the two tractors out. And so we will with Combine too. And then at last year, we'll probably drive around the map. This one. Okay, I'm really liking this. I always test if you can go through the tires and you cannot on these two. Yeah, you can't. Get it. The interior, it's pretty much the same as the 8R. It moves and everything. It's just like that. It sounds better too. Drives, operates functional, lights work, as expected. Turn signals, do work. Alright, I'm liking this one. The top speed is 32 miles an hour, and the cat also has a top speed of 26. Probably should test this on the steering wheel, but I don't really care right now. So, I, I've seen videos of this cat being pulled with this, so I'm guaranteed it'll pull it just fine. I don't know it's. Rated, this is rated for 450, I think. Let's check real quick. Um, yeah, 420 actually. So this is about, that's about 95, it needs about 95 more horse to pull this, I think. Or 85, I think 85, I don't remember. But PT, the hitches work, look really nice on these tractors. All the stuff, everything works as expected. Alright. Oh, that's not a mod, by the way. I was just looking at it. Oh, for anything else, probably space that machine shed. Did it show up? I don't know if it did. Ain't that a bummer? It 
It did not show up. I don't know if I may have forgotten to put those in my files. Alright, we'll just test these two for now. I will be coming up with more of my spotlights, by the way, just saying. Oops, didn't mean to hit that. Is that place ready to harvest over there? I think it is. I'm gonna just buy this field behind the shop here. Yeah, it is. All right. That was a it's a one X map, but it's very basic, but it's very good for how early it is that is being released. But I'm telling you, this is a very nice combine. All the models is it goes from 9670, 9770, 9870. And they, besides this one, the other, the 9770 has boots and everything in the cab here. And then everything like that. I just bought this land, okay? Thank you. Functions very nice. Everything works very nice. I'm not having the crop texture on here. I just added that to the file, to the Google Drive thing. Just for the sake of doing it because I was probably gonna probably put that in the next mon spotlight I've seen everybody it works very nice so yeah it'll look a lot different these beans and corn will look a lot different here you see it works very very nice it's, you know I spent to do this another stripe back here to me this miss a little bit but it's just mon spotlight so not the big video as you can see everything works nice in the cab Monitors and computers all do work. They all do represent something. The mirrors do work. So I do, I've been using this quite a bit, as you can see in my let's plays and everything. I'd have give this a ten out, a five out of five star. Very nice machine. It's early in the game. First up with the polling challenge and see how well it pulls it is a cat 75C. I know it'll pull it just fine because the tracks and everything. But this next mod spot will have a lot more mods to do. Pulled it just fine. Seven miles an hour. I think the top speed on it is nine. Oh, seven. Okay, it's pulling it just fine for not having like 80 to 95 horse. Quite good. Real like this tractor, you will be seeing me use this quite a bit in my Let's Plays. Plus, it has a three point hitch, and that's something that the uh, 90 day. Uh, 82 did not have the three point hitch. So, as for polling and everything, the whole mod 10 out of 10. Sounds very nice, sounds like the ones in the game, but doesn't matter. It's just about the mod, I guess. The engine makes it sound better, but alright, the last up. Yeah, eight R, American style. Very nice having an American eight R back in the game. Oh, this only goes six. Kind of, that's kind of good. I mean, I like obviously, but that thing is has way less horsepower than this. About 80, about 75 horse less. And it's pulling just fine. I mean, it and it pulls mile an hour faster. That's pretty good. Well, that's just for this one. Um, 
let's go do the let's shut for these mods. Let's go to the like around the map here. This is a you can buy this in game by the way. If you pre-ordered the game, like I'm guessing a lot of people did, you get this no matter what. PlayStation, console, whatever. There's the obviously where you get your vehicles. This is the cell point. And right now it does not have anything, it doesn't show the prices, but you can sell there. There's where you buy your animals. Let's go down here and look, I guess. Pretty nice. And they get the animals behind that barn there. There is no place you can see, because, but that's how he likes it. He doesn't want to see those marks where you get the animals at. There is another farm. You can purchase it and everything, but like I said, does not work just for looks. The church down that left road there that you just saw go by. Uh, another op work up, like you can buy this and work with it farm. Has a big machine shed. No storage, just a machine shed. It comes with that plot of land down there. They, this down this road is just all the fields down here. Did a very nice job with all these rivers. This is the guy that made UMRV DR modding. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Um, looks very nice, functional. I played on this quite a few hours now. Very very nice map for how early in the game it is. As I've understood, he's been working on it ever since FS19 came out. So, it came out on the, actually on Christmas 25th. Alright, let's go check out the other two farms. Then I will probably have called it. Gosh, this thing slides so much. I'm gonna be a little mean here. We're just gonna go across here. Whee! Oh, we landed it. Bridge is very nice. I really like that bridge. Cell tower over there. Uh, this is Mitchell Farms. That one back there was Gilcrest. Gilcrest, I think. Yeah. Here is the other. There is the uh, gray men's for this farm. The ones over at the other farm um, storage here. The other ones at the other farm do uh, look a little different too. So they're different and everything. Here's Rose Farm. Rose Farms little. I guess Rose Acres, but. It's a little bit smaller, only got one machine shed there, but it gets the house and everything. Not the biggest in the world. I think it was really made for horses. I don't really know if it's for, if you're supposed to work on it or not, but. I guess that's more of a horse farm. I think that's where he wants to put horses built in the game, because like down here, he has, he wants to put the cows here, so that you don't have to like, buy your own, like, Thing it'll just come. You buy the farm and you get the pasture and everything, and you might start out with cows. This is a big boy farm here. You come with that house and everything up here, but you can't actually go in it. But look at that, the dryer even's even working. This is a nice farm, a really nice farm here. It's called the Kellogg Farms. And then yeah. All right, we'll get out and look here. A little bit smaller of a, of a uh, grain set up here. Small little shed here. Here's your bigger shed. Then here's where the, where the cows would be. He's going to design the barn a little different when he comes out for that. Very nice pasture here. Looks like there's everything's very nice. 
there are, I think, 30, 40 fields in this map. Yeah, 40 fields. Huh. Sorry about that. Uh, but, yeah, I'm going to call it here. Thanks for watching. Uh, there will be more mod spotlights. And if you want to find the mod below, you can find it below, like I just said. <laughs> and, yeah, thanks for watching, and bye.